How many times in golf have all of you had this short little shot that you're close, but there's a lot of rough in front of you, and you've got to just you got to just flop under it, get it up. We just don't want to go in the bunker with it or go over the green. We want to give ourselves a chance to get it up close so we can knock the putt in. My Harry Taylor designed dimple sole wedge will actually have less turf drag or less sand drag and will slide through any surface actually easier than if it did not have the dimples in there. The way these are, are built, you don't have to sit there and really open the club 30 degrees or whatever you're trying to think about. How much should I open this club to loft it up? There's plenty of loft on this club and with this sole design, you just put it down there squarely behind the ball, take a nice little swing and it's gonna be up there close to the hole. My first thought was, well, this is original. This is unique. Let's see how this works. What I noticed was how crisp the shots were when I would hit them. Traditionally with wedges, I think that's the that can be difficult to get them to be a nice crisp shot, but this is almost like it was automatic for me. First time I've ever seen a Harry Taylor wedge, and uh, I'm quite impressed with the results out of the sand trap. The Harry Taylor wedge does slide uh, much smoother through the sand compared to what I've been using for the last five, six years. I miss a lot of greens and regulations, and I need to find a way to get up and down. When I hit the Harry Taylor wedge, the ball landed softer and ended up closer to the hole. The material that we use when we designed this club, it's made of a 303 stainless. This is a very soft material for a stainless steel. Actually, a 303 stainless is softer than a 1025 carbon steel, which is a forged golf club. So the 303 is gonna give you a very soft, solid, great feeling golf club from the first time you try it, you're gonna say, wow, that club really has such a soft feel. As we talk about the face of this golf club and as we've talked about, it's completely milled, perfectly flat. The grooves are milled perfectly in this face of the club. So if you don't have the milled face, milled grooves, you're just not gonna get the play or the performance that you expect out of a Harry Taylor designed wedge. With all these technologies that we have here, from the dimple design, extra wide sole wedge, the milled grooves, the milled face, the great material that we use with this club, the great shaft, the grip, and we're able to bring this to you at a fraction of the price that other companies are asking for their premium wedges. We have a 52, a 56, a 60, and a 64. My Harry Taylor designed dimple sole wedge is gonna help you get the ball out of the bunkers, out of the rough, out of the fairway, closer to the hole than you've ever been before, and you're gonna enjoy playing this club.